Hi, I'm Steve Schneer, a systems engineer in battery management solutions at TI. One of the most common questions I get is, how can I reduce the size of the wearable I am designing? Most wearables are small and meant to be worn on the wrist, while some need to be even smaller. The main components of the wearable are similar, and the size is determined by two things. The size of the battery and the size of the electronics board. Battery type and capacity determine the size of the battery, with some compromises. Primary cell batteries have the highest energy density, meaning they deliver the most power in the smallest and lightest form factors. The most common are button cells. However, they have to be replaced by the user when they run out of energy, which can be difficult and inconvenient. Rechargeable batteries can easily be recharged by the user, but have roughly half the energy density of primary batteries, and require a lot more complex electronics design. If the wearable you are designing is very simple, and you can reduce the energy consumption to make it last at least a year between changing the battery, then primary cells may be worth considering. However, if your application has many features, you will want to use a rechargeable battery. To reduce the size of your electronics board, you will want to choose a recharging solution that also integrates other key features of your wearable. The BQ25120 integrates the most common functions, including a linear charger, low quiescent current DC-DC switching regulator, configurable load switch or LDO, push button input with reset output, and a battery voltage monitor. These are the minimal set of functions found in almost all wearable devices to power the microcontroller, Bluetooth wireless chipset, and sensors. The total size of the highly integrated BQ25120 solution is less than half the size of the smallest discrete implementation available today. The charger performance and other functions has increased, while the current draw has decreased. The wearable now has extended battery life, improved functionality, and the wearable design smaller. Let us know what other questions you have when designing your wearable solutions. Post your questions on our E2E page found at the link below, ti.com/batterychargerse2e. Thanks for watching.